On examining the American phenomena of money, social climbing, and star fuckery in the late 20th century, after Diane Seuss. I was married to a McDonald's millionaire in the 80s. Growing up poor, we two embraced upward mobility, embracing each other a tougher problem. But why not climb? The nation all, its morning in America, greed is good, trickled down the decades improbable pretense. The golden arches wrapped us in the Boston Ritz, where over Waterford goblets of oranges fresh squeeze, eggs benedicted on bone china, I glimpsed Jackie Kennedy Onassis seated beside us with Caroline and her husband. So I say to Jackie, as if we're sleepover friends, what brings you to town today? Without skipping a beat, Jackie's famous whisper caresses the conditioned air like sea breeze. We're attending a reading at the JFK Library. You? Then lifts her full Bouvier lips into graciousness. Me thinking I've pulled it off. Come a long way from Spam and Scrabble. I'm a Jason American aristocracy. By the prosperous 90s, I've earned a PhD in a divorce. Still surprised and at home with dinner next to Dolly Parton tiny as a toy, the only voice from the hollers in that Broadway tattoria, later sharing a Lincoln Center elevator on my birthday with Wynton Marsalis, craving a kiss from American jazz royalty, brushing his trumpeted mouth with mine.